In this video, I am going to solve this first order linear differential equation. So let's go ahead and write the standard format for first order linear differential equation, which is dy over dt plus sub, some function of t, p of t times y is equal to g of t, some function of t. If we compare these two equations, this one and this one side by side, we see that p of t is the coefficient of y which is 3 over t. Now let me go ahead and solve the equation. As you know, uh, we have to use uh, integrating factor. Multiply both sides of this equation by the integrating factor. So we know mu of t the integrating factor mu of t is equal to e to the power integ integral p of t dt which is going to be e to the power integral 3 over t dt that is going to be equal to e to the power 3 integral dt over t that is e to the power 3 ln of t because integral of dt over t is ln of t that is the same as e to the power ln of t cube and i have used this property here a is a constant ln x is equal to ln x to the power a now the exponential and natural log they are inverses of each other. So these two are going to cancel each other out because they are inverse functions. So that gives me mu of t is equal to nothing but t cube. t cube. Now I am going to take this mu of t and multiply both sides of this equation by mu of t, which is t cube. If I do that, I get t cube dy over dt plus t cube times 3y over t is equal to 5t times t cube, which is t to the power 4. So t cube dy over dt plus, if I simplify this, is going to be t goes into t cube t square times, so it's going to be t square 3t square 3t square y is equal to 5t to the power 4. Now this left hand side as you know is nothing but the derivative of the product of mu and y with respect to t. So mu in our case is t cube so this is the derivative of t cube times y and that is equal to 5 times t to the power 4. At this point, we can take integral of both sides with respect to t, integral of both sides with respect to t, dt. So now left hand side integration and derivative, they're gonna take care of each other. So leaving me behind with t cube y is equal to 5 times on the right hand t to the power 4 plus 1 which is 5 divided by 4 plus 1 that is 5 plus some arbitrary constant c so on the left we've got t cube y is equal to 5 and 5 cancel out that gives me t to the power 5 plus some constant c now if i divide both sides of this equation by t cube On the left this and this is going to cancel out is going to give me y is equal to t square because t to the power 5 divided by t cube is t square plus some arbitrary constant c divided by t cube now this should be your final answer so this is the solution to this first order differential equation I hope that this discussion was helpful and thank you very much.